video ever filmed on this channel. I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm doing this for fun. Let's see where it goes. A little background on me. I'm a heavy farm equipment mechanic and I've been doing that for five years straight. And uh, I love my job, but this is my hobby. And I figured, you know, I watch a lot of YouTube videos of people building bikes, fixing bikes, working on bikes, riding bikes. And I figured, I do that. I do that. Why, don't, why not film it? So I figured I'll film it and see how it goes. See how I like it. A little background on me even further. When I was a small kid, I had a hard time learning in school. My first grade teacher told me I was a moron. I was never going to achieve anything in life. So from that point on, from six years old on, I had very low self-esteem and motorcycles saved my life. When I was nine years old, my dad bought me this motorcycle and it gave me a bunch of confidence. It gave me a pleasure, gave me a reason to get up in the morning, gave me a reason to live, to be on, to be like perfectly right on the dot. Yeah, motorcycles saved me. I'd be hung on the, I'd be dead. I'd be, I, I don't know. I don't know, because I, I got a motorcycle, and it saved me. So, from that point on, I had a motorcycle, and it gave me a reason to be, and when it broke, I had to fix it. I wouldn't say this one broke a lot, it's pretty reliable, pretty bulletproof, but I've had many motorcycles, and I had a CR125, and that, that thing was broken all the time. I had to rebuild it all the time, because I was putting a lot of hours on it, and I mean, when I mean a lot of hours, I mean... In the summer, I put it somewhere around two or three hundred hours. Now I'm two five. That's a lot of ring changes and a lot of piston changes. So I was constantly opening the engine <laughs> to change the piston. So I learned how to, to fix things, and it, fixing things gave me a pleasure and a satisfaction and a confidence and everything I needed. So this is my first motorcycle ever that I've ever had. My dad bought me that when I was nine years old, and it's it's in rough shape. You know, it's it's seen wars and it's been in, it drenched in water and it's been through all sorts of things. And I'm I'm using it right now as a pit bike. I'm using it as a, you know riding it around the yard with the nieces, little nieces. I got two uh, two little twin nieces, and um, they have a little XR50, well CRF50, but whatever, same thing. And uh, with this, I'll be able to follow them around the yard, so they won't be riding alone. And my sister will be able to ride this around with them and have fun with them. And the tires are shot on it. It needs new chains, new sprockets, new air filter, and I have all this on the bench right here. If you wanna, I'm just gonna take this off. I hope it doesn't shake all that. I don't like shaky cameras myself in videos. So let's take this off the table. Two tires. I went with Dunlops and uh, everything I need. So a chain, a front sprocket, a rear sprocket, some brakes, air filter. And I've been looking at this a little bit more closer and there's a lot, a little bit of play and I don't know if you're going to be able to see that on camera, but I'm going to reposition the camera and show you what I mean. I've been looking at this and there's a little bit of play in the spare. And that's in the pivot under the shock. And there's a little bit of side to side play too. Well, you won't be able to see it on the camera, but. So, I'm not gonna change those bearing out right now, but I'm gonna order them. And at some point in the summer, I am going to change the, the swing arm bearings, the pivot bearings, the shock bearings, I'm not sure if this shock actually has bearings, I think it just has bushings, but I'm going to take this motorcycle and make it not like new, but in very good condition, in good riding condition at least, so we can have fun with it. So this is an intro introduction to me and motorcycling and having fun and all sorts of things. So um, like, subscribe if you want to, <laughs> and uh, share, and uh, tap the not notification bell. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. In the next videos, we'll be in the next video. We'll be uh, you know, working on this and making it ready to to do some dang wheelies on it or or putting it around for fun with it. Peace.